Aggravated assaults in the Central West End, they're up. They're way up. They more than quadrupled in June compared to June of last year. Five on your side, Jenna Barnes introduces us to a woman who lives there and she's working on a plan to reduce crime. Jenna's live in the Central West End. And in art, it is a beautiful night here in the Central West End. We've seen a lot of people sitting outside enjoying this weather, and that's what so many people love about living here. But this woman says they all need to come together to combat this spike in crime. You're a good girl. Patty Hill walks everywhere with her border colleague Claire. It's one of the reasons she chose to live in the Central West End. It's just so incredibly beautiful. I love it so much. But no love is without its bumps in the road. The crime is rising. Crime in the Central West End is up three and a half percent over this time last year. I had on my phone for a little bit the apps that give you real time, the real time reports. It was too much. I got rid of it. The biggest issue is larceny. But last month, there were 11 aggravated assaults. That's five times as many as June 2017. I think we just as neighbors, we need to put our foot down and say, stop it. That's why Patty is creating a citizen's patrol. This should be, hey, Clarence. She's getting her neighbors together to figure out how to make their streets safer by working with police. It's good to see you. <laughs> good to see you. And the Neighborhood Security Initiative. Pulling people together and getting back to some of the basics, knowing your neighbors and communication. United by their love of this place. And I don't walk around afraid, but I don't think anyone else should either. So Patty says she already has 20 neighbors interested in joining this citizens patrol. Their first meeting is July 18th. Everyone is welcome and we posted all of the details on KSDK.com. Live in the Central West End, Jenna Barnes, five on your side.